So welcome back to Dot TV. It is your girl Elda. And if this is your first time tuning in, I welcome you with love, hugs, and kisses. Mwah. But in order for you to be my cousin, right, right, I need you to go ahead and hit the subscribe button. Then I need you to go ahead and hit that bell. Then I need you to light up the comment section with hashtag Dot Cousin Gang. And you'll officially be my cousin. Those of you that's been rocking with your girl, what's up, cousin? What's up, for me? You already know how we get down. We be like, welcome back, back, hey, back, back, hey. So y'all, God is good, right? God is good, and I just want to have a conversation with you, cousins, because lately your girl has been. Uh, I can't even tell you, y'all. Like, I can't. I haven't found the, the the perfect word to describe what I have been feeling for the past, you know, couple of weeks. Right? I know y'all. You rock with me on Instagram. I know y'all see me posting. I know y'all see me go live. Yeah, I'm doing the chamber of prayer. You know what I'm saying? I'm pre I'm preparing for the men conference. But when it comes to me, when it comes to self, when it comes to my mind, when it comes to my life, I've really been having a very strong desire to increase the quality of my life, right? Increase the quality of my life, being very intentional about my mind, intentional about my peace, intentional about my growth, intentional about, you know, tapping in into another realm with God, right? And, um, and I know one thing that I, I, I said from the beginning when I first started this channel is that, you know, I want to be transparent. So, and I pray that my transparency encourages you, right? Because sometimes we may feel like uh, we're the only ones going through something when all actuality, you're not. And, and sometimes this is why it's good to watch other people or listen, you know, to other people that are on the same path as you, because there's times where they will be able to articulate what it is um, that you're not able to it helps you form the words right so listen cousins um when i say increase i mean i'm talking about increase all right your girl is already bougie i already like nice things and you know and it's just like i'm not satisfied on where i am I know the word of God says, you know, to be content in whatever state you find yourself. You feel what I'm saying? But it doesn't mean that you necessarily have to stay there. And if you didn't check out that podcast, look in the description box and you will um, go listen to it. I think it's about eight minutes long, right? I was talking about find, being content, finding on how to be content in an uncomfortable uh, season, right? So let me tell you what happened to me the other day, cousins. Um, I started to check out this young lady's page, right? And I'm not speaking down on her in any way. In any way, I am speaking on a general, a general base here, right? So, um, I met this young lady and, um, let me wait for the, uh, y'all, I'm on the balcony, so. All right, back to what I was saying. Um, I was checking out this young lady's page, right? And... I was just like, when I met her in person, I was like, yo, you know, she's dope or whatever. Let me check her out, right? And when I began to go through her page, um, you know, I seen her, her her followers were up there. You know, we're in the um, double digits, you know, a couple of thousand, almost, almost, if, if not 20,000, it was close to almost 20,000 something followers, right? And when I began to go through her page, you know, um, you know, checking her out, liking, supporting, you know, doing what I do. Um, I realized, you know, she was only really promoting one thing. So I said, okay, cool. No pressure following her, you know, keep it moving. And then I began to have a conversation with, um, 
one of my sisters because like I said I'm in the process of increasing the quality of my life so and in part of doing that I'm very intentional about some of the content that I will follow so that means yeah I went to unfollowing people because I have to be cautious of what I allow in my spirit in my mind in my you know heart I have to be cautious and sometimes you know I love y'all but some of the stuff that people post is if it don't where does it serve me purpose right where does it serve me purpose so then I began to um, have this conversation where I was just like man I was following a lot of people that has the look right um, especially when you're an emerging influencer you know when you when you you know somebody like me you know um, emerging influencer you know I'm a speaker I'm a coach I'm a minister of the gospel I'm all these things and one thing I strive to do is to make sure that whether it's on on an IG live or a Facebook live or on my podcast or here on my channel or you know whatever it is that I do I try to make sure that you are encouraged that you are empowered that you are inspired that you are motivated in any way and through me speaking um, I pray that you are able to get some form of strategy right but what I can't stand is when you have these people right they have the look but they are empty inside right they are empty inside because I'm telling y'all after I was done you know checking out homegirl you know I began to look at my page and I'm like well what will bring people to my page you feel what I'm saying um, because of the society that we live in you know you you women most women feel like they gotta post their bodies to get a like or you know what I'm saying um, it's just like where where are we authentic where are we being true to ourselves and I just bless God for the whole Holy Spirit because the Holy Spirit had to check me and be like don't you dare compare don't you dare compare yourself to anybody right your process is your process your road is your road your path is your path right because I'm like yo I'm dope I'm dope I'm dope I am dope I am dope and anybody that comes in that that encounters me in any way you're gonna be motivated you're gonna be inspired right you're gonna be encouraged heck you might even laugh because you know that some people call me comedian I'm like I don't feel like I'm funny like that but I guess I'm your unofficial comedian right so I don't I'm, I'm just like a part of me uh, detoxing mentally emotionally spiritually and physically right because sometimes you know everything that we're going through begins to take away on your body when it begins to take away uh, 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 when it begins to um, affect your body then guess what it affects your progress it affects your work it affects your the quality of your work so listen y'all I'm I'm really I really 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 want to do this fast and I'm like uh, this fast um, at this consecration and this detox because I know that it's going to shift me I know that I'm going to ship. I know that I'm going to propel forward, but you know it's always going to be a fight. Anytime you make a decision um, or anytime you 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 get aware or you understand that you have to ship or you get intentional about something, you know there's going to be a fight, right? Because the enemy doesn't want you to tap into your higher self. The enemy doesn't want you to tap into new realms in God. So now as I'm on this journey, I just want to remind myself, right? And I'm reminding you cousins, like I remain transparent through my process so that you can be encouraged because I don't want my, my, I don't want to say fans. Okay. This is why I say cousins. I don't want you guys to look at my page and I'm giving you false hope or I'm giving you, um, you know, yeah, a false hope. I don't want to give you misleading information. I don't want to lead you on and I'm not able to give you or pour into you anything. I want to make sure that when you come, you see the process, you see the glow up, you see what I went through, even if I'm not talking about it because I'm in the current season or you know but you know that I will testify you know that I will put it out there because listen I want you to know that it is not easy 
but once you come to a once you come to a place where you begin to trust the process, y'all. I know I'm talking. I'm looking at the water while I'm talking to y'all because y'all, I just added this new little plant to the balcony, right? And yeah, it just gave me a whole little vibe. So yeah, I'm just like y'all. I'm feeling it. Like I'm feeling it. Like yo, I'm feeling it. So I just can't wait to relay um, the the fake grass back on the balcony, y'all. But anyways, that was a square moment. But, you know, I want you guys to be able to see. I want you guys to be able to be like, you know, yeah, Elder. Yeah, now that, that's a real one right there. You know, um, she showed us the struggle. We went through the process with her. You get what I'm saying? So when, So that when I speak, listen, listen. When I speak, my words will carry weight. That's all. I just want to be where I speak, whether I'm speaking about God, whether I'm speaking about encouragement, when I'm speaking about motivation, when I'm speaking about inspiration, when I'm speaking um, or I'm giving you a strategy, I want that word to hold a weight, to hold a weight because you know and that you're able to trust what it is that I am saying because I'm not posting one thing and I'm, no, 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 I kept it real from out the gate, I kept it real so as i'm increasing the quality of my life i need y'all cousins i need y'all to keep me lifted because this thing ain't easy right because we got to be the first partakers right we got to be the first partakers so cuzzo i want y'all to drop in the comment i need to i need to know what are you doing to increase the quality of your life what are you doing whether it's mentally emotionally physically financially what are you doing to increase the quality of your life but yo i love y'all okay i'll be waiting for y'all in the comments if you ain't subscribed yet get it together get it together hit this subscribe button hit this subscribe subscribe right now okay but i love you baby be blessed, be encouraged, and remember, you have victory on every side.